What's up, everybody? <gasps> it's your boy Uchi, and uh, back again, once again. How y'all doing today? We got episode five, the Holy Digimon. Now we know that Tantamon was teasing that Kabuterimon Digivolution from the last week's preview. Last week we did get to see Bergamon in action as well as Greymon, but most importantly, we got to see that fresh, unique Digivolution, brand new, never done before. I loved it. I think it looks really sick and it's definitely unique to the show in itself considering that back in the day if you remember how the old digivolutions uh, were and if you didn't Agumon, Digivolve, and comparing it to last week's I think that we're gonna be in for a very beautifully animated and awesome series that I keep telling you guys. And a quick little bit of an update. I appreciate you guys also telling me what's good in the comments for any of the things that I might be questioning. So I thank you guys for being super nice to me and patient and understanding that there's a lot of Digimon on the screen that I probably won't even know because like I was when I was a kid, I didn't even remember a lot of them back in that day too. So here we are now, episode five. As far as the series goes, I believe that we might see this for at least a 50 episode run of some sorts. So we'll see. So that'll definitely last us through the, rem the rest of this year for sure and into next year. So with that all being said, guys, why don't we just get <laughs> Do you like anime? Do you like Japanese inspired things? Do you like clothes? I'm sure you like to stay warm. Well, I got this stuff for you. Introducing Imori.com, a website that introduces anime and Japanese inspired styled clothing made in house. And you can use the code Uchi15 to save yourself 15% off of all these cool, dope hats, beanies, hoodies, t shirts, sweatpants, and way more where that came from. That's Uchi15 at checkout to save yourself 15% off your entire order at imori.com. Also, I cannot wait for the soundtrack to officially release. Dude, the one other thing I wanna say is that like, don't you love when like an anime gets a reboot or a remake or just comes back all together with some kind of continuation and it seems way more anime than it ever was when it first came out because I don't know about you guys but when I watch Digimon along with Pokemon Yu-Gi-Oh and a bunch of other shows like Dragon Ball Z before I even knew what anime was I just considered these shows shows like like not even cartoons but then when like they come back they just feel way more anime than they ever were like I guess then we realized then I just think that's fire Ooh, I got a pre-order. That just reminded me. I got a pre-order one of those freaking Digivices. They're like $100. Also, if you hear fireworks in the background, it is the 4th of July, so happy 4th. If it picks up on the mic, I'm sorry if you do hear it in the background. These episodes literally drop every Saturday at 10.30 p.m. Eastern time on the dot. So the timing on this one was just that great. Oh, Feel my words. Yo, what Digimon is that? Yo, is that, dude, are they like teasing Angelmon or something like that? And Angelwomon? And why are they teasing them so hard? I feel like for this series, they're making those particular Digimon like a huge deal for some reason. I'm actually really interested in seeing why that is. Also, this one's called Waymon. Dude, I don't know, but you see these other Digimon that's that's on the statues? They kind of look in OD. I really love how they display the Digimon names on the screen. Kind of gives me My Hero Academia vibes. Whenever they display their name and then their hero stuff. The children who possess the Digivice. Digivice. They're the ones that govern the good of the digital world. What? There was a large war? Dude, was this a thing like in the original or is this like all new? Because if this is all new, I'm all for it. I'm just, I just want to put that out there. What the hell? What? That's like mad devil mons. So they went to battle with all the darkness. Whoa, you saw it. Yo, I never seen those Digimon before. These are like the angelic mons. Oh, <gasps> oh, there's yo, it's War Greymon right there. Yo, I love these teases. That's so fire. This is gonna be insane. Yeah, Omnimon or Omega Mon, dude. This is amazing. I am loving this lore. Like I said, if this is brand new, <laughs> what yo. 
That's fire. This is fire. They're crying. I wonder if they were reborn. And that's that was them back in the day. I believe that a new darkness will be born in the future. The dark Digimon will begin making its move. Oh. Evolution will eventually reach completion. Continue further into infinite boundaries. So these Digi Destin, these children. The chosen ones. They're calling them the chosen ones in this one. I wonder if Digi Destined was the outside Japan made thing. Yo, Izzy just said that the power was out in Japan, but these people still had internet. Imagine that. What the hell? Oh man, look a bunch of Spider-Mon. No, don't be destroying the only like holy sacred Digimon place that they got. Ogre Mon, I remember you. Dude, this show is so fire. Absolutely. Oh snap, the darkness is gonna rise against them. They gotta cross this sea. Aim for the continent, the light and hope who fight amongst warriors. The first big quest, they gotta find the holy Digimon. I need this game to happen. Digimon the RPG featuring the events of the anime. I need it, please. Dokugumon? Dokugumon. Say that 10 times fast. Tylomon. Those must be those smaller shark looking ones. Oh yeah, that's right. They're they're actually in the Waymon right now. Oh, you're gonna make that John throw up. Smart. Yo, why does this remind me of the freaking scene in the opening of Pokemon when Butterfree is holding Bulbasaur, I think? I don't know who was holding who. <laughs> this just reminds me of that. Or was it Pidgeotto holding Ash? Y'all know what I'm talking about, right? Pokemon! Pepper Breath. Damn, they're trapped. Soundbirdmon. Okay. Looking like the freaking Zubat of Digimon. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Oh, damn, that was close. That's what's up. Tentomon's protecting Izzy. Oh, no. Oh, it's time. It's morphin' time. That was the buffest I've ever seen Tentomon. Oh, dude, this new insert song is fire. Oh, come on, my son. Oh, dude, if this is going to be every week, I'm so ready. This is sick. Oh, we got Bergemon. Man, they went right through that, John. Here we go. Yo, they're all unique, I think. <laughs> Agumon gets that special one. I'm sure Gabumon's gonna get the same similar kind of one, I think. Like, he's gonna get the same kind of special treatment like this. Like, this is OD. This animation is so clean. Yo, everything about this is is fire. Meanwhile, we got Kabuterimon handling business too, man. This is freaking sick. What the hell? Yo! Yeah, they better run. You know, I just peeped. Kabuterimon kind of looks like he has like a samurai helmet, like those old Johns. It's fire. Damn, is he transferring that knowledge? Uh oh. Is this Devilmon? Oh my god. The pacing is ridiculous. I, I can't believe we're seeing Devilmon already. Then again, we saw Omnimon literally in episode two. <laughs> What's up with that? With the feather. Oh. They said we trust in you and now it's fading away. <gasps> Here we go. Yo, I think her her hat used to be pink. I'm with it. Guys, I really have no complaints about this show at all. I think I think this this season of Digimon is going to be uh, amazing. Like I had my worries, but to be honest, like I really think that if what I'm thinking originally was correct about like them adding all this lore that was never there in the first place or maybe it was, but I just don't remember. I think what how they're doing it, how they're executing it is literally all amazing. All this is great. And the ending songs. All the songs. I need the soundtrack. I need the soundtrack. I need this. This song is the only one that's available right now. Everything else, the opening, the insert song, then the soundtrack itself. Don't know. Taichi meets Mimi. The Targeted Kingdom. Oh. All right. So now that we know that they have a goal in mind and they have to reach the holy Digimon, that is the whole purpose and what they are going to try to achieve within this season or series. And I don't know if they're going to have a 50 episode run, kind of like how they did back in the day. If it's going to be any longer, any shorter, but who knows? Do you guys think that th this, that they're going to end, they're going to reach across the sea and to that other continent to find the holy Digimon, the light and the hope by the end of the series? Or is that gonna be something that they tackle firsthand and then they get into like another thing? Like like this, this right here, what they're doing is one arc and then they're gonna have multiple arcs. Is it gonna be like that? Let me know in the comments what you guys think. But as you can already tell, I thought this episode was fire. I'm already looking, for looking forward to next week. Like I feel like I'm never going to be upset with 
on a single episode of Digimon Adventure 2020. I think this is going to be freaking amazing from start to finish. This is a banger series. This is how you do reboots. This is how you do reboots. Five episodes so far, so freaking good. Sound off in the comments, guys. Let me know what you guys think about it. As always, like, share, subscribe, hit me up on Twitter, all that good stuff. Supporting links are going to be in the description below. If you'd like to see more Digimon content out of me, also let me know that as well. And if you want to see other stuff that I'm working on, definitely check out my video game channel at Uchi Games with a Z. And if you want to support the channel a little bit more, then you can definitely consider becoming a member. I am planning on doing some streams for you guys, some kind of exclusive discussions about this, about other animes, because there's plenty of other stuff that's happening this summer alone, and there's a lot to cover, so I can't really do all of it. So I think having discussion streams might be something that would suffice. But again, let me know. Have yourselves a good one. May the power protect you. Keep it locked little right here on this channel. Stay safe, stay clean, stay inside. I'll see y'all next time.